Good day, viewers. Once again, I'm greeting all my subscribers, and I'm today here going to reveal some great herbs that are there for the benefit of humanity. If you're a new person here, I want you to subscribe. Subscribe, I need more subscribers. This is Comb Herbal TV, and I want to reveal to you today about these herbs that are very good and for the benefit of humanity. These herbs are used in great purposes, and you will know it as I show you. They are for healing, they are for protection, they are for favor, and they are for love, and they are for all purposes. Today, I have three herbs here. I'm going to show you by number one, this herb. This herb has the dawa dawa three herbs. We call it dawa dawa. We use it for soup. Some use it for soup. That's the, the dawa dawa fruit. It's from the fruit of this that we use to make dawa dawa. That everybody buys to add into his food and soup like spice. This dawa dawa leaf that so many miracles and that so many healing first of all i'm going to speak about the spiritual uses of this leaf the dawadawa leaf this is the dawadawa leaf i know most of you know it yeah it does so many purposes the back of it if one has a boil at the back of at any part of his body and you get these three back you go and cut the back with a cutlass then if you cut the back you come and pound it and mix it with lime you add lime water to it and pound it and make it a paste so as you make the paste of these three back on it you apply it at where the boil is i'm telling you within the next 45 minutes going the boil if it is a young boil, the boil will burst or it will get strengthened and healed. For the next three days, the boil will vanish. So it's one thing about it is that it uses for, it used to cure boil. That's the back of this tree. This tree, if you're having a serious promise and fail, you see that what you do, you don't prosper. You see that uh, you always have negativity. If your friends go for an interview, they get work, and when you go, you always find it wanting. I'm telling you, this is the solution, finally, for all people. I want you to subscribe, that I will reveal more herbs and more secrets for the benefit of humanity. If you are someone always having, always not getting good luck, I want you to get this out of our leaves as much as you can't you get as many of them but before going to the tree get powder or corn flour and give to the tree and seek for permission that you want to use the leaves for this spiritual bathing so you get a large quantity of these leaves you come home after giving the tree the powder or the corn flour you get a large portion of these leaves. You will come home and pound it into paste. You add salt to it, salt stones to it. Then add a little honey. Put it into a new bucket, a rubber bucket, a new one. Put it in a rubber. Don't put it in a metal bucket. Put it in a rubber or a clay pot where this paste and salt and honey will be mixed inside and add water and stir it together to turn greenish. After it turn greenish, we will pour in this water and be bathing at night. From 11 p.m. going, you get this uh, the leaves that you pounded with the salt and the honey and the bathing from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet for seven good days. 
I'm telling you all the problems that you are encountering, all the promise and fail, all the bad luck will vanish and good luck and prosperity will begin to come to your spirit and soul and body. And that will live long and prosper. This one cleanses man, makes you pure and whole and make you have good luck in all that you do. You get it? At the same time, you have always have headache, headache, headache. You go to this tree, you, you dig and get the roots, the roots of this tree. You put it, you cut it, the roots into pieces in a bowl, inside a bowl. Then you get a kanwa base, a kanwa and after it, and let it be there for some two or three days. Then you'll be drinking it and washing your hair with it. All long time headaches will vanish and you get sound mind and good health and no stress again. It removes stress. and gives you sound mental alertness and sound good health. This leaf, when boiled alone with moringa and drinking is a tea especially in the afternoon, it cleanses the blood. It makes your blood pure and whole. It removes all dirtiness from your blood. It purifies your blood and makes you forever young. So this does forever young. That's the physical aspect I'm talking about, you know. It makes you forever young. That you always um, look fresh and whole. That's the leaf of this Dawadawa of moringa, if you boil it as tea and you're drinking, it cleanses your blood. It removes dizziness from your eyes. Someone always have dizziness, so you are drinking this, it removes dizziness, it purifies your blood, and it makes you whole. That's one uses of it. You see that it does wonders. And then at the same time, it does uh, serious protection. Should I discuss it? If you're a new person here, I want you to subscribe for me at the bottom low. I need more subscribers. After that, I will begin, if I get more subscribers, thousand going, I'll begin to reveal more things like this. You know, if you need protection, serious one, whereby you want all your enemies who want you down to perish and die within 30 seconds, you get the leaves of this Dawadawa tree. As usual, you get the powder or the corn dough, corn flour, and give to it before you pluck the leaves, asking for what you want. Then protection, then you get the leaves. You go and fetch sand. Sand, full hand. I get in it. Then you get 42 needles, needles, needles that we used to sow. Then you pound the leaves inside a new bucket or new pot of clay pot, you pour the sand by saying, if my enemies can count all this sand and dust within 30 seconds, then they should get me. But if not, may these needles kill all of them within 30 seconds, every minute, every hour. May they be perishing. Then you pour in your sand. Now, if the enemies can count this sand within 30 seconds and the dust, each particle within 30 seconds, then they should get to you. If they can't, then they should all perish. You call all enemies, father house, mother house, workplace enemies. They add it to the leaves of this that you pounded. Then you add the 42 needles. Stir to it together inside the water. Pray Psalm 51 three times, Psalm 91 seven times. Psalm 35, seven times, and Psalm 109, seven times. And light on your red candle and pray with these pounded leaves, the sand, full hands, then the 42 needles inside a new port, saying if the enemies can count these leaves, single one of these leaves, and the sand and the dust, each particle, within 30 seconds, may they be able to get you. If they can't, may they all perish. Then after that, you read the Psalms and pray and bath for seven days. 
you buy this, I tell you, in 30 seconds, all your enemies will start perishing. Each 30 seconds, all your enemies are perishing. And you hear that they are dying. And then after that, the seven days, you will now gather all these particles remaining with the needles and the sand and go and throw in to the dust bin, the dust, the boiler, the, rub the refuse dump, or four cross root. I get in it. So this leaves that so many miracles and healing. It's for good luck, it's for protection, it's for healing. If you want more, I'd use this with other herbs for soup. When you buy this soup, I'm telling you, with uh, the soda apple leaves and other things, I'm telling you, of the barakuruga leaves, kankanga leaves, gar leaves, toa leaves, serious herbs that are accurate, that soup. If you need good luck, and add cowries powder to it, old in this morning, powder, grounded powder, add. So if you're bathing, you're bathing water, and all times money will begin to flow, come towards you, and enter you, and you begin to prosper. That soup, you bath it on Mondays and Fridays alone. If you need this soap, call me 024-34-89751. 024-34-89751. The more things that this does, this is part one of it. The second one we want to show is the neem leaves. This neem leaves, this is the neem tree. For the meantime, I'll show the physical uses. If someone is not feeling fine and you suspect it's fever or malaria, you get turmeric, grind it into powder with this neem uh, leaves. Turmeric, turmeric, you grind turmeric with neem leaves, then into powder and make it into paste. Foot, roll it into foot into balls and each day you take two each day you take two or two spoons of it each day one in the morning one in the evening i'm telling you every fever every anxiety every depression every malaria in your body will vanish and you will get healing in your blood at the same time when someone has severe malaria you get this neem three leaves you get purple leaves, you get gava leaves, you get uh, nunumda scent leaves, basil, of the purple leaves, that's the part, are you getting it? They boil all together and be drinking. You begin to see good health coming, malaria. These same th leaves, three of the new tree, if one has a very serious enemies worrying him, in the night, you go to this tree, as you stand in this way, you stand and remove your clothes and stand naked and go and hold the tree and tell the trees all your problems, the enemies that are disturbing you. If you know some of them, you mention their names to the tree. After saying all this to the tree, Put down your coin to it, get the leaves, come home, mash it inside water with salt and bath. The next day, go to the tree again, say the same thing for three or seven times, seven nights. You go in the night and do that. You have serious protection. All your enemies will perish as you bath with this with the salt. I get in it. At the same time, this leaves, this neem uh, tree, it sucks my, uh, mosquitoes away. If your room there are mosquitoes, you set fire, then you burn it. As the smoke is flowing like, flow inside the room, all mosquitoes will die and run away. And your room will be having a sweet aroma of good perfume of neem and you have sound sleep and sound mind and wake up always alive, you get in it. Neem tree does so many things. It does spiritual cleansing at the same time. If you want favor, if you want, if you're in the workplace <coughs> and then 
You find out that you are hated. <coughs> you get neem leaves and get honey. <coughs> you pound the neem. You see? You pound the neem leaves into paste. Then you add water to it. Remove the solution, which is greenish. Then you add the honey to it. For so add this honey and mix inside the bottle. You'll be smearing it. I'm telling you, if you are going out, always favor. Those who hate you begin to love you. This leaves with honey. You mash this and add honey inside the container. And be smearing it. You'll be getting favor wherever you go. Add it with what? Coconut water. And you get love and favor. In everything where there's hatred, you will be loved like honey and cherished mysteriously. Are you getting it? That's the power of this neem uh, tree leaves. It has so many things. I'll show part two on it. This Susumansa. Susumansa. If you wake up in the morning and get the stick of it and eating as I'm eating, it's divine protection. No evil can come near you. Those who send your name to the shrines, all the evil plots will backfire. And favor and mercy will be our portion forever and ever. I get in it. And one favor, you can use it for favor soap. You get many of these leaves after giving the coin to the tree. You pound it, add a good perfume of your choice, and add it to the soap of your choice and the bathroom. You'll be getting good market. I, I do that. You go to market and get a leaf, a tree in the market. You pluck the leaves and add to this and pound. Add to the soap of your choice, add a good perfume of your choice. <coughs> you begin to love and get good market. You become a crowd cooler. When you get this one, the leaves, Susuman side, and then you get a. Uh, Mofra Mofra body leaves and cook it together and drinking, malaria is gone. It heals you of every malaria, physical and spiritual malaria. This one with bitter leaf, cotton, three leaves, use it to treat tuberculosis. That's so many miracles. I'll show a lot of it on part two. If you're a new person here, subscribe. I need more subscribers. More things will happen. So I told you if you need me, to call me, call me out my number that I swear about. Call me, subscribe, and I shall reveal to you more secrets and more powers of the herbs. Green herbs, yeah man. <laughs>